Hey, teachers and parents, hints and tips after the story. Oh, amazing! Hey, Steve, can you help me, please? Uh, not now, Maggie. I'm watching a great TV program about wild animals. <laughs> oh. ha! Okay, then. Ha! Let's have some fun with a little Maggie magic. <laughs> Abracadabra! Shoot. Go away! <laughs> That didn't taste good. What happened? My tongue was really much longer and bigger than this. Hey, show me your tongue. Well done. Oh, look, an elephant. Oh, that elephant has got bigger ears than me. Oh, wow. It must be fantastic to have really big ears. You can hear everything. Abracadabra! Oh, hey, my ears are getting bigger and bigger. Oh, I can hear everything. I can hear everything. It's too loud. Oh, stop, stop. Oh, oh, oh that's better. Hey, my ears were really big. Big! Show me your ears. Make them bigger and bigger ears. Yeah! Oh, this is so crazy. It must be Maggie Magic. Oh, where is that naughty, naughty bird? Uh-oh. Look at that monkey. It's got really big eyes. Oh, hey, look at my eyes. They're getting bigger and bigger. And bigger! Hey! What are they? They are eyes, they are eyes, they are eyes! Say it with me, what are they? They are eyes, they are eyes, they are eyes! And again, what are they? They are eyes, they are eyes, they are eyes! Oh, but hey! I can see everything! Woo! Wow! Oh, <laughs> and I can see oh. Maggie! Maggie, <laughs> I can see you! I'm here! Oh! Oh, oh, oh no! Maggie, my eyes, oh. my eyes, my eyes! Oh. Oh. oh! Maggie, you naughty bird! Sorry, Steve, but ha, it's good fun! It's good fun for you! Yeah! And look, another elephant! Oh. Oh, not an <laughs> elephant again! Oh. <laughs> Abracadabra! Oh. Ah, my nose is getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> oh, but hey, I can oh. smell something nice. Oh. What can I smell? A flower. Uh -oh. Be careful. Maggie, help. Help. <laughs> Maggie. <laughs> wow, you can fly. So fly, Steve. Fly! Yeah! Oh, Maggie, I can't fly. Look, I've got arms. I've got hands. And look, I've got fingers. I haven't got wings. <laughs> OK! Abracadabra! Oh! <laughs> oh, wow! Hey! I can fly! I can fly! Oh, this is amazing! Wow! <laughs> Maggie, I can't touch anything because I haven't got any fingers. How can I eat? Eat like me! Eat like you? Okay. Hey, what a crazy clip. Hi there. This clip came from the Wow Orange Book and it's from a unit about the senses. So this video quickly reviews the body parts important for the senses, such as eyes that are used to see and ears to hear, etc. And it passively introduces the verbs to see, to hear, to touch, to taste and to smell. If your child uses the WOW Orange Book, then they had a homework task and it looks like this. The task is to simply watch this video story and number the pictures as they appear. Oh, and there's also a great colourful worksheet for teachers to use in class. 
which practices the new language together with the grammar from the previous unit, simple comparatives. So as you can see, the sentence here reads, the zebra's ears are bigger than my ears. But hey, as we're looking at senses, I would like to remind you that it's important to remember all five senses when teaching English to young learners. Children can vary greatly and can respond better to different sensory input. And it's quite often that we concentrate on what we can see and hear in the classroom, but we forget the other three. Multi-sensory learning incorporates numerous senses in order to better stimulate the brain, to help learners retain more information and to engage all the children regardless of their learning style. This way of teaching can also inject a lot of fun into the classroom. Why not try playing blindfold taste or smelling bottles or the activity feely bag? It's a great game to let all those senses run wild. For more information, see the What's English Game Bank or the Teacher's Book. Thanks for watching and uh, please like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye for now. Bye bye.